Hey guys, Iceman here. And a fan of mine on YouTube's posted this on my page, man. It's his prediction for the upcoming Godzilla vs. Kong film. And check this out. In the first little nitbit he has here, it claims that the G-Force is creating something, or there's a secret project going on, known as Gigan, which is an acronym, check this out, for Global Intelligence Gigantic Autonomous Neobot. That's right. They're working on this project, man. And he's a hideous thing. Something probably of great power. And then it goes forth to see the second project. Which I don't really know what's going on here entirely. It's kind of hard to tell. But there's some pyramid-like structure. And uh, it looks like Godzilla and Kong are perhaps fighting. I don't know. There's some big-ass spider that looks like Humunga from the Godzilla comics. So that would be epic if we get to have a glimpse of some other monsters like that. Now, it has been claimed that there's going to be other monsters involved in this Godzilla vs. Kong film, so perhaps Kumunga will be one of them. And then right down here it goes, three months later, the weapon escapes. So, Gigan, it seems, uh, starts to become a threat. And perhaps things are going haywire with Gigan. While meanwhile, Godzilla and Kong battle it out on what seems to be Skull Island. But then all of a sudden, a new threat comes forth. And check this out. There's Gigan, where it seems that he's uh, causing destruction upon a city. And a freaking beam. That's one of Gigan's powers, is that big-ass beam that I think it shoots out of its eyes. Yeah. Or its uni-eye, anyway. And uh, it's probably caused some massive destruction. So that would make an epic scene to see this new threat and the capabilities of it, especially Gigan, a very well-known enemy kaiju in the Godzilla Monsterverse, or Godzilla Universe, that is. So Gigan would be an epic thing to have, and I know a lot of you guys want to see Gigan, as a lot of you have commented on my videos that you hope for this to happen, something of this magnitude, you know what I mean? Where Gigan is exposed. So all of a sudden, uh, the chapter known as The Fallen King, where they're battling it out, and it looks like Godzilla blasts the shit out of both of them, Gigan and Kong. Uh, whether or not it, Kong was intentional is kind of uncertain because it seems that Kong was behind Gigan in this instance. So maybe Kong is like grappling on its back or something. And then Godzilla knows what it has to do in order to defeat this threat. So he blasts his ray at the right time and destroys them both. And look at this. Here's Kong's body with just its skeletal remains, other than the head. It's pretty whack. And a statue is made of him. And the city is destroyed. But nonetheless, uh, Kong is recognized as heroic. And it seems that Kong is dead. And then all of a sudden, a post credit scene. See, this, uh, this reveal of freaking King Ghitra. Yeah. So... Some epic stuff here. And this could be uh, a Kong 2. Skull Island 2. So how the hell is Kong going to return? Perhaps that's the cliffhanger. I don't know. But uh, a pretty interesting scenario. What do you guys think about the setup that this guy created? And do you hope for the film to go something like this? Let me know in the comment section below. Uh, here's a little description that he went on about. The Gigan project is made of some of Gigadora's skin, uh, and the humans make Gigan, but is infected by a virus. So that's what happened. And the ending battle of Kong and Zilin Gigan is inspired by the first fight in Dragon Ball Z. Huh, just some interesting notes regarding it. By the way, a little Easter egg. A rodent egg and Mothra larvae plus Kamakuras. Oh, could be Easter eggs in the film as well. Ah, uh, interesting, but, you know, the, the Kamakuras must have been this guy up here then, I think. The uh, mantis-like thing. Yeah, but what do you guys think about that whole setup? Let me know in the comment section below. And how do you hope Godzilla vs. Kong to go? And who do you hope to be the main nemesis? Because it has been stated by the director that there will be a main nemesis who the two team up against. So let me know your thoughts on this in the comment section below. And like this damn video. I'm the Iceman. More videos to come.